a car of yours, well, a wet. Um, got this nice thing of feed, eh? It's a little infinitum battery desulfator. I'd like to bend this for any one of you, that's just the customs. You never know that. They'll send you an email for this, and that's just normal custom check your stuff. That's, that's okay. I'm fine with that. Now, this product will fix your batteries up like new. There it is. So that's your packaging. Infinite of battery desulfator. Maximize battery life. Span two to three times. Revive dead batteries. Cars, motorbikes, golf carts, marine vessels, forklifts, solar batteries and more. American technology. My 30 year old battery went from a nearly dead battery to starting a 4.5 litre engine. Like a new battery. Joe Grant, audio enthusiast. Indiana, USA. So that's a product review. So this tells you here, audio inspection. Uh, yeah. Yeah, here's your little graph here. How it installs, it's in parallel with your charger or on your car. Yeah. This is if you want to stick it to the side of your battery, but first test I want to do, I want to desulfate the battery in that red van out there. Because that battery's had a bit of, that battery there on that, that van has had a bit of um uh, power pulled from it and yeah, it's it's a little bit tired, so this is the first initial test of this thing, so yeah. I'll just briefly read the instructions for a bit and I'll get that um, battery up and going. I'll see how long this takes to revive and yeah. They reckon it takes anywhere from what, probably 24 hours up to a week or two depending on where, how bad the battery is but being this battery in particular, I'm going to test it with, it's just just been charged and starting too many times so it's been sitting and sitting so this is his first initial test, so I get this going and yeah, let you know. Okay, the also the battery is connected to the charger, charger is not plugged in. It's indicating the battery is full, but not a full 12 volts or maximum recharge voltage. So I'll hook this up. All you do, connect it as, as say, I'll just hook it up so I can hold the camera at the same time with the one hand. I know a million things I want to see. That sit down there. I find something to sit this on. Hang on. Let's see. I'll sit it on. Here we do. Hang on a minute. I'll do it off camera. Okay, viewers. Basically, that's how you connect it. So straight out of the packet, the little connectors just hook it up just like that. Now the green light is telling me on this paper. It's where is it? LED status indicator. Operation is green, so it's on. It's working. Now red, which means it's low voltage, but yeah, it's not actually full, full 12 volts. It's, it hasn't got all of its cold crank in it, so use this to pop its cold crank in it. So I'll let it go for a couple of hours and we'll see how good it goes. Let's unplug this unused accessory, I don't need that. Nothing plugged into that. Plug it in. It's charging. Now, the charger is just telling me that the charge is putting, yeah, tell, that light there basically tells the charge is on. But when the battery's full, like, like it's if it's brand new, that light will be lighting up bright, like that one. So if I listen carefully, I can hear the battery bubbling, so let that go for a bit. And I'll keep you updated, so yeah. This will be part one, so thanks for watching.